film is essentially a visual medium, um, and you tell a story by juxtaposing images with each other. I mean, one of the things I love about film is that, in fact, it's such a bastard art. Okay, you have to start with a script, a script, a script, but actually, there are so many other heads that come to making this thing that you, you, you know, and it's so ephemeral as well. Mm -hmm. um, you know, in the you know, a, a couple of rolls of film don't mean anything to anybody, whereas a bronze sculpture, um, you know, can be sitting on the country, in the countryside forever and ever and ever, and then someone discover it. First and foremost, I mean, we have to acknowledge that cinema is a form of entertainment, and if a film doesn't entertain, then it has failed. I guess what I always love is the entertainment part of it. Like, in the end of the day, you're writing a film so you can play in front of an audience, and it's amazing how you forget that as you're going along the way, like, or, you know, so, I mean, part of it you've got to write for yourself, you know, and, but the other part, you, you know, you have to entertain the audience. Why would you have all the seats out? and not want people to sit in them. I think of course you want people to, to see that work and to be moved by it and engaged by it intellectually and emotionally. Is it an art form? I mean, that's a bloody good question. We would sort of very strongly argue that, that film is an art form and can certainly be read as an art form in what it's trying to do. And it's much more complicated in some ways than more traditional art form. And so it has to sort of play with being commercial. It has to play with audio and visual imagery. It has to mix generic. F There's so much it has to do. Cinema can still be radical. It can still really interrogate um, society and it can be political. Cinema is not purely an artistic thing. It's, it's uh, a weird, weird business. We're talking about an industrial process that's very expensive. You have to make something that's going to be relevant to a large audience, that is going to pay back the cost of it, produce a profit for the people who funded it, because at the end of the day, that's the only reason films get made anyway. I mean, as much as you know, cinema snobs or cineists, or whatever you want to call them, would like to separate like the art form and the commerce, I mean, they, they affect each other. Box office success is an important factor of any film production, but equally um, telling stories that resonate within a culture is important. And, you know, if they don't make it big, well, that's not necessarily the end of the world. It comes back to the, I suppose, industry versus art form debate and how we conceptualise Irish film and trying to allow both approaches develop is really the, the, the challenge.